Katrina? Yeah. Damn. I've seen on the news there's all kinds of crazy weather going on. I know. Like, literally, I just pulled up to my house. So I'm waiting for it to, like, stop raining so I can get into the house. I don't want to get wet. It was all my bad. I just went to the grocery store. I've been so shady on the phone to Sean, ignoring his phone calls, and I know he's suspecting that something's going on. I mean, I did some shopping and stuff. My cousin is last week the kid, and I'm going to be for a little while, so it was nice to like get a break away from children. You've been watching them all weekend, haven't you? Not all weekend, but she's been helping. I don't know. I just like cabin fever. <clears throat> This storm is literally like my life right now. As I'm getting closer and closer to seeing Shane, it's getting harder and harder to talk to John. All right, babe. Well, I'm gonna get off this phone. Okay, baby, I love you. you All right, baby, I love you too. Bye, baby. Bye, baby. I'm feeling really guilty at mine to Sean. This is like a lot more than what I bargained for. I don't know how much longer I can keep doing this. Where are you, Tony? I just hope he is who he says he is. Last night, I stayed at a hotel close to the prison. <sighs> okay. I'm just, like, so nervous at this point. I've sent pictures to Shane of myself in, you know, sexy outfit. And I fell for Shane because of his sexy voice and the really good conversations that we've had on the phone. He's fun, he's outgoing and sweet. But I've never met him, not even on video visitation. I'm engaged to another inmate. And I've never cheated on my fiance. I really honestly feel like I'm still in a dream. I can't believe this is like really happening right now. This trip has been absolutely crazy. I've had to drive up mountains, the rain, it's been pouring, now it's cold. Like the weather is not cooperating with me at all. I like, I made it. I'm happy I made it. <laughs> prisoner that's getting released this morning and we've never met in person so I'm nervous that I might go up to the wrong guy. What if they look alike? <sighs> He'll be out any moment now. I'm really really getting nervous. <sighs> butterflies in my stomach right now sitting outside waiting to finally meet Shane when Shane walks out it will be the first time that we've ever seen each other in person my first impression of Shane when I saw his picture was oh my god he is so sexy I hope that he's even better looking than the picture and I'm hoping when he sees me he likes what he sees my fiance, Sean, is also incarcerated. He has no idea about Shane. But Shane is very outgoing and sweet. Shane is very affectionate. He is funny, romantic, and he could possibly be the guy that I've been looking for.
website because I felt as though I wanted to connect with a female. That's what I met Lacey. And I feel as though like she might be the one for me. For Lacey to drive seven hours away to come meet me, she must be really interested. I'm just so happy to meet the love of my life. <laughs> really good. Lacey is my beauty and I am the beast, I guess. Oh, no. <laughs> come on, baby, let's go. <laughs> so cold. This is my first day out in four years. I want some good breakfast, some nice clothes, have a good conversation, get to know each other a little bit more better. Holy <laughs> I should've put myself in the back seat playing. Holy <laughs> Shane wants to get breakfast. Oh, I will be his breakfast. Um <laughs> You're so beautiful. Mm -hmm. I cannot wait to get you alone. Mm -hmm. Like right now. <laughs> mm -hmm. I came here to meet Shane, and Shane has exceeded my expectations. Sexy. <laughs> I just cannot keep my hands off of him. He feels like so good. Like this is finally real. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> I'm feeling really happy to finally be out of prison and be with the love of my life. When I come out here and I see all the trees blossoming, it's really nice. Right now, I feel free. Well, we definitely need some sexy time. <laughs> Today, it's more relaxed. This is by far the most happiest day of my life, getting to meet Lacey. She is a wonderful person. She got a wonderful personality. I love everything about her. She has, like, such a big heart. That's really the main reason why I really like Lacey. I can see us, like, carrying out a relationship. You look so sexy. I don't mean to be cheesy. Like, I really love her smile. <laughs> I want to see something. She's like... What's your basket? Uh... It's like I forgot how to operate a damn phone. There's kind of, like, I haven't operated one. Can you give me a call later? I want to go do something. No, don't worry about it, girl. I love that. What? I can tell we've got to get on the phone. 
I'm not upset anything. Like, okay, I'm not upset anything. Like, you don't want to talk to me? Like, what's up? I do want to talk to you. I just said to call me later. Like, you always call me at, like, time. I'm tired of it. I'm tired of it. What? You're tired of what? Calling what I asked you to call? Where are you right now? I can't hear you. Is what that, is it? I'm just phone. It is strange for me that Lacey got out of the car and walked around the side of the car and she got on the phone. Do I trust her? Yes. I feel as though I can trust her. Hello? Hello. You okay? Yeah. Your phone call go all right? Well, I'm not ready to tell Shane that John's in the picture. I don't know if you ever want to talk, I'm here, okay? Telling him would ruin this romantic, crazy chemistry that Shane and I have. It's complicated, I guess. It's getting stressful keeping this whole thing a secret. There is no way I'm going to be able to juggle Shane and John. It's just not going to happen. I feel like I'm going to be having to make a choice really soon about who I want to be with. So, I don't know. I like everything about Shane. His smile, his eyes. Like, this is finally real. Before, it was just a picture. And this is way better. Yeah, I'm so happy <laughs> I'm finally out. I'm free. I'm I with know. you. Face to face. I can touch you like I want. Look in your eyes. I'm happy. I'm just... Like, I feel like I'm in a dream right now. <laughs> <laughs> Everything's like kind of like a first one. Like, Wait. it's my first time meeting you. I know. It's you know, my first day out of prison. A lot of firsts for me, too. Mm hmm I've been talking to Lacey in prison for about three months. The first impression I thought of Lacey when I seen her pictures, I was just blown away by how beautiful she was. I thought it was kind of, like, too good to be true. I didn't feel as though at first I was getting catfished. I don't know. That's, like, kind of what makes it exciting. I can't stop staring at your eyes. Your eyes are so beautiful. <laughs> but now that we met each other face to face, I know... You know, she's real. So you're like really beautiful. Like, why don't you have a boyfriend? Um. Well, I just like recently got divorced from my ex husband. Tell me more about that. Um, he just was like really controlling. So we've been separated for a year now, and my divorce just got finalized. Really sorry to hear that. I mean, you deserve better than that. I would never do anything to hurt you, ever. Thank you. I just want you to know that. I, I want that. you to feel safe with me. I feel horrible. I'm not ready to tell Shane right now about my relationship with Sean, but I could definitely see me and Shane developing a stronger relationship. It feels to me like we've known each other forever. You're really beautiful, and you, you really have a great personality. Talking with her, we actually have a lot in common. What did you want to go tonight? Let's just go hang out at the hotel. Relax, get acquainted. <laughs> Interesting. I really feel like Lacey is the girl for me. Well, let's go ahead and get out of here, then. Hey. Hey. We finally made it. Hey, Miranda, I'm Shane. Shane. Yeah, it's nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. I've heard a lot about you. Good things, I hope. <gasps> Lacey really surprised me. When she told me about Shane, definitely came out of left field. When John gets out of jail, it's going to definitely upset him, and I think that it can become a, a lot of drama that nobody's really foreseen. <laughs>